what up guys it's your boy mookie and we back at the airport i'm finally leaving new orleans and i'm actually going to be taking it's not a long flight but i have a 12 hour layover today um so we leaving from new orleans to colorado i'm gonna be actually be in colorado for 12 years so i'm gonna try to experience colorado and vlog in colorado while i'm there and then we're gonna leave from colorado and go back to vegas it's only two hours but it's the layover that's gonna kill me tune in to the video let go Stop. Hold up. Now let get active. Let get active. Let get active. If you are new to my channel, please make sure that you like, comment, subscribe, and share. We call those four things on my channel getting active. So if you are here and you're looking at my face right now, do not be a lame and make sure that you get active. Let go. This is flight on time. This time, guys, I'm riding Frontier and not Spirit. Flight Denver 479-506, we're on time. Let's go. Guys know when you come with me, it's never a trip unless I'm drinking. I'm um, already drunk liquor earlier, so I'm gonna be drinking wine. Um, if they have a nice little winery in here. Um, so I'm gonna be trying three different wines. I'm, it's backwards, so I'm trying to say the names, but I might mess it up. Puglia, this is a Mendoza, and this is a Carinina. Carolina, I don't even know what those are. They tell you everything about them, so I'm gonna taste these. I do have a beautiful salad that looks delicious. I have about two hours until my flight leaves from New Orleans to Colorado, so I'm gonna enjoy this. I hope you enjoyed it too. And it's gonna be the Puglia. It's gonna be from Lupe D. Oh my God, some of this stuff is hard. I'll zoom in on it so y'all can see it, but it's supposed to take like jam and oak. And it says the nose has hints of red fruits which merge on the padded of sweet and spicy notes of wood. A drinkable wine with a great structure and a long, persistent finish. And it's supposed to be. Uh, it does have that dry taste. Taste it. Taste it, just taste it. Don't worry about it. It'll give you a little dry feeling after. Not my favorite. Okay, and remember you, but you really don't like red wine. Um, this is the Mendoza's from the winery's Cantina. Um, grape is a mailback, year 2017. It's supposed to be raspberry and mocha says the mouthful is rich and full with notes of sweet spice and a touch of leather leather okay the finish <laughs> presents soft well integrated tannins with bright crisp acidity that gives the wine exceptional length let's see and i do this third because i need my smell this one smells way better for the taste though. <laughs> okay, all right, this is the Karenina. Um, the winery is Bodegas Cares. The grape is a ganache. And it's the year 2017. So it's supposed to be dark cherry and chocolate. Mm. So the aromas of black and rare fruit on the nose hint of black cherry chocolate and vanilla finishing with caramel and a long silky tannin finish. Okay, so I'm kind of scared of this one because of my previous experiences. Wine that had the vanilla taste has been disgusting for me ever since I found out vanilla comes for the anal glands of beavers. <laughs> I'll try. I told y'all I would let y'all see everything that was in it in case I was pronouncing anything wrong. Here I go. Gotta show y'all the art 
that I'm seeing. Oh, I love, I love this one. Oh yeah, I love this one. Oh. Stop, I gotta take a picture of that one. Oh, it's good. it gets better. Look at this one. Richard Oz Thomas. Okay, Richard. That boy Richard got some talent. So in Houston and in Louisiana, I'm gonna have to wear a mask. But now I'm in an airport, I got this mask on and it feels so weird and so hard for me to breathe. Like it only been like a week, but bruh, this mask is killing me right now and it's itching my mustache. God. All right, the first two hour flight is down. I just got to Denver. Now, we just gotta wait 12 hour layover. See what we gonna do. All right, mob, so uh, we decided that we're not gonna get a hotel or anything because I wanna be cheap. Um, so we're just gonna stay in the airport for the entire 12 hours. Right now, I'm at the Panda Express because I am starving. I had drinks before I got on the plane, but I didn't have any food, so I need to hurry up and eat something. Panda Express in Denver better be good. I've been wanting Chinese food when I was in um, Baton Rouge, but no Panda Express in Baton Rouge. And everybody that I've seen in Baton Rouge told me not to eat the Chinese food because it's not really Chinese food there. So it wasn't real. Um, half and half. Half and half for what now? What now for you? Um, teriyaki, mushroom chicken. No? What do you have for you, son? Um, mushroom chicken. Mushroom chicken. Um, and? What else here? Chicken. Um, Kung Pao. One more. Um, broccoli beef. That's what. Right. Thank you. Okay, so we I, I need to do something to kill time. I got 12 hours and I just finished eating, but when I was passing, I saw a lady selling some stuff that I liked. It was a hat and stuff. Ah, uh, but it does not look like she is here. Looks like she has left. Oh, wow. I wanted something from this place I was actually I was actually right now I was going to get a 
I was going to get a hat, but she's not here. So I seen another place at the, actually at the end um, of the airport. And I'll go to that place. Okay, so a bad thing about vlogging in the airport is that it's music playing occasionally in the back. And I don't want to get the music in the back because then it gets copyright claimed and all type of crazy nonsense. And I've been working hard on this film, so Ooh. I don't want to ruin it. Probably not this edit that last clip I already know because I didn't catch it until too late. It's cold in here. I got on shorts. I'm sleepy. What's up, mob? It's um about to be six in the morning. I probably only got about thirty minutes of sleep, bro. Um, and I flight to be here in about two hours. I need to get some breakfast, so I'm at McDonald's. I'm starving here. Literally, I'm starving again, so I need to indulge. What up, mom? I finally made it to Vegas after that long, long, long vacation and that long, long um, plane ride. Finally here. I'm waiting on my mama because my mama is who is here to pick me up. Um, she's kind of lost, so I got to search for my mama, y'all. Look at my babies. Hey! Hey! I'm back with my kids, y'all. Huh? Yeah, you're going to make it right. Back with my kids. I missed them so much. They didn't miss you. They had granny. 